wanted to fill you in on part two of our popsicle light box we have in the first video made a panel and depending on how you want to design your light box you want to make you can make three you can do a triangle you can so you would do three of these you can do a square without a top which you would need four of those and if you wanted to put a top on you would use five now the other way that you could do this if you wanted to be real sturdy is you could make two squares of popsicle stick and attach them to each other and you would have four popsicle or you would have eight popsicles sticks per square now if you did that if you're making the triangle you would need six squares of four that's 24 if you were making four you would need the two you would need four for each and four which would be 16 or if you were making the five you would need the 20. So what we're going to do, what we've done, this is this is what it would look like if you did that. You're using eight popsicle sticks per panel. Eight popsicle sticks per panel. So you would need that many popsicles. And what we've done is we took our piece of paper and we took our stamp we made ourselves a stamp using push pins and cork board or styrofoam. If you've got styrofoam at home, you can use a styrofoam plate. We pushed those pins, push pins, through the cork board of the one piece. And then we mashed that together. And we made our pattern. Now you can do patterns or you can do what I call on the starlight pattern. And you just punch holes. And when you hold this up to the light, if you put this to the light, the light will shine through the holes in the paper. Now, we're going to, this is part two, we've got two of our panels here, two panels. We are going to put them together at a right angle, okay? And this will be the first side of the first side of the light box okay and you're going to take your wood glue and you're just going to run it right along the seam I'm going to do this and then I'll hold it up so you can see it Hold it so that it'll stay together the way I want it to. But you'll have put the seam together and you'll wood glue it right down the middle. And you'll let that dry at a right angle. Okay? If you're making the box, it'd be the right angle. Now, if you're making a triangle, you would not make it at that right angle. You'd make it at about a 45 degree angle. Yeah, 45 degree angle. Make sure my math's right. At about a 45 degree angle, so that it would look something like this. And then you would put the third right here. Okay? So that's part two. As you're making your angles, you're going to put your two pieces, your two panels together. And depending on which way you want to go with it, you could put the different angle. If you're making a square, you'll put it at a right angle. If you're putting it at a triangle, you're gonna make it at a 45 degree angle, and then you go to, you would go ahead and put your panel together. Okay, so that's part two. We'll be back with part three where we're gonna actually join the two right angles that we've done for our box, and then put the top on it. Hope everybody's doing well, having fun. This is popsicle light box. 
should be pretty easy for you guys to try it out. 